Look at this water! Woo! Aruba! I don't know what you say. Like, I wanted to say aloha, bienvenidos. I don't know what you say. But we are in Aruba, you guys. Oh, beautiful beaches of Aruba, you guys. We are so excited to be here today. Guys, we are jacked out of our minds. Let's get that energy up. We are in Aruba. I think it's very hot. I think right now it's scorching out. We just got umbrella, some chairs. We've got wave runners coming. We're going to be spending an hour on the wave runners out in that gorgeous turquoise blue water. It's so pretty. This is mind blowing, you guys. This is the most beautiful beach I think I've ever been to. We're going to be spending the entire day here. We're pretty jacked on that. As you guys can can see rocking the TISWB ABC merch. Yeah. You guys can pick it up right now at this is how we slash swag. I do believe we have some men's and kids' tanks left. Women's are gone. Ladies are gone. And honestly, we haven't had much internet, so I'm not sure there's any left, but go check it out. Lanyard as well. I think those are actually gone I mean, too. You can actually wear the men's, just maybe size down. Guys, this amazing guy right here is digging us a little hole to put the umbrella in. Yeah. Welcome to Aruba. Yeah, welcome to Aruba. Thank you, bro. This is amazing, guys. Great first start, great beginning to our journey, our epic adventure here. First port of call. We're gonna do it up right big time all day and you're coming with us our own little slice of heaven right here today there you go we got the umbrella we got the gear i am just mind blown at how white this sand is like i can't get over how white this is in this water you guys i can't even see through the camera because it's so bright out here but i'm assuming you're looking at very bright bright blue water right now Wait, what did you say, Brexy? Moana water. He said, oh my gosh, it looks like Moana water. It does. I feel like I can walk up to it. It's going to part and I can find a little seashell. All right, Kirby, are you ready? You going to send it? Aruba, baby. <laughs> Woo, how does it feel? Okay. Looks like it's from Moana whenever she got that little seashell. Dude, that is exactly what Brexy like, just described the, it as. The sand just looks so both kids now have described this as a scene out of Moana where she walks up to the edge, it parts, she dips in, gets the seashell out. They're like, the sand is perfect, the water is perfect. It looks like a scene out of a movie, out of an animated cartoon. That's how perfect this setup is, you guys. And it's a little bit windy, but not nearly as windy as it typically is in Aruba. So I feel like we've got the perfect day here. You guys know that you can open your eyes in ocean water. I used to think that that was something in movies when they would open their eyes. I'm like, that's not realistic. You can't open your eyes. They'd burn in the salt water. And then we were on a cruise. The water was so clear, just like this, that I forgot it was ocean. I thought it was a pool. So I opened my eyes and it wasn't until I've been swimming for like a few minutes that I went, wait, my eyes are open underwater in the ocean. It doesn't hurt at all. Fun trick, guys. Open your eyes. Underwater in the ocean. Who's you want? Sandy. in Aruba you guys this is incredible I can like see my feet the water is so beautifully clear it feels it's delectable it's amazing we are just loving it Check out this contraption Daniel brought. Leave it to the engineer to bring this freaking GoPro dome. I don't even know what this is, but it gets half underwater, half above water footage. So you guys gotta go to their channel, Dan and Shell. Check it out. I'll link the video for you. And they're gonna be doing some over underwater shots all along the cruise, like this whole time. Hopefully it's cool. I don't even know how it looks yet. I can't preview it because I can't get to my GoPro, but I think it's Literally video. trying it for the first time, but it does have like some lines on the back that says like, take it underwater to here. We won't know until we get back and review the footage, but so far, I love the concept. I love the idea. This We've been swimming be underwater, jumping up and down. Down, get half above, half under. Go to their channel, check it out in today's video. You got an idea? Oh boy. Wait, hold on. We had one. Way Maddie went. Oh, <laughs> 
We had an incredible time out here playing in the water. Oh, We've been yeah. going for about a couple hours now. It's now time for what I've been looking forward to most, what the kids have been looking forward to most, and that is the Wave Runners. We've rented three Wave Runners it's for the next so hour. Fun. Cruz got his ball back there. Just behind us here, you can see the Wave Runners just tearing it up out there in the ocean. We're gonna go take okay, three Wave Runners fun. out on the open ocean. Three two-seaters, so six of us at a time. So mom's gonna hang back right now with Brex and Hazy. Brex wasn't that stoked. I don't think he loved it in Tahoe. Hazy just wants to play in the sand and in the water for the next hour. It's all Wave Runners, baby. driving this thing. We're gonna head out. So There's back. some light blue water. The barriers are this crane down here and another crane clear down there. So a ton of ocean to work with. And then there's a light blue water strip out there that's another barrier. I say we head to that right now and go check it out. Let's go. We just got major error, bro. driving his we got michelle and maddie over there on their wave runner maddie's off driving hers this is truly caribbean living doesn't get much better than this this is everything oh, right here, right here. <laughs> to see crystal clear blue water all the way to the ground underneath you. This is amazing. You guys are like sharks circling us right now, by the way. We went and checked with mom. Turns out Brex doesn't want to do it. Mom doesn't even really want to do it. So we're just going to run up the rest of the time here. We're actually almost out of time. We're going to go send it for a few more minutes. Then we got to turn these bad boys back in, get together as a family, and probably have some lunch. You guys down to eat something? <laughs> Food in Aruba. Okay, let's go. Woo! Right out here, kids. We're back fresh off of our wave runner excursion. Now the kids are a little bit burnt out on energy, but how was it? Fun. Pretty awesome. I drove your town. It was so much fun. Dude, you were a boss out there. Right guys with me, he was going full speed. It was so rad. Dan and Shaw have a good time out there on the wave runners. Oh so yeah. Fun. Mindy, how were the wave runners? It's good. Did you enjoy? I mean, it was like the, we did the donuts. The, the, I when the, we were like, chasing the, the catamaran. Just, like splashing your face and stuff. I didn't go, but I was willing to not go. We are reapplying sunscreen for the third or fourth time today. The sun is blistering hot. The sand is is so white it feels like it's just reflecting the sun right back on top of us it's coming from every angle so what we're gonna do now we're gonna eat we're gonna hydrate so we got a fun shack over here that's got some traditional Arubian foods burgers fries <laughs> burgers fries dogs. all of the standard Arubian fare I don't think Arubian is the word by the way do they say Arubian a Reuben that's what I'm having for lunch for I could go for a Reuben. let's go eat get some hydration get some water in us get sunscreen maybe grab a little bit of shade and then we'll finish off our fun time here in Aruba before we head back to the boat
Hey, it is Arubian. Rex is looking over the menu here, some authentic Arubian food. Rex, what looks good to you, buddy? Uh, yeah. Anna. The fish heads? Yeah. We found this place called the Fisherman's Catch. I don't know what it's called, the Old Fisherman, the Old Fisherman. It's authentic Arubian cuisine, which I now know Arubian is a word, and that is what you call it. We were just told that their specialty, one of the best things they have is the pineapple curry shrimp. Guys, I'm ordering it for sure. One, because it was our first recommendation, and I want the most authentic Arubian experience. Two, I just saw it on someone's table. You guys are gonna die. It comes in a full-size pineapple. I'm I'm ordering up the pineapple curry shrimp. Kids have found some fun stuff off the kids menu, and we're about to eat finally. We're so hungry. I'm not really into like the shrimp and fish, so I think I'm just gonna get a regular pasta or something. They do have pasta, which is great for the kids, right? And Brex, you're getting that fish head? That Arubian wind coming in at us right now. We have had all the fun we can have out here today. We are sunned out, funned out. Kids got some subies. Hazy girl, and Hazy girl's thinking she got a little bit of summer. I think she either got some heat exhaustion or she just swallowed a ton of salt water because she's not feeling well in her tummy. So we're gonna get back on the ship right now, shower off, clean up, and get ready for the rest of an amazing night. Pretty awesome time here in Aruba? Yeah, definitely. One of the best days we've had so far. We just came out to catch this amazing sunset. How stunning is this? Wrapping up the perfect day in Aruba. It's been absolutely magical from start to finish, guys. Our favorite day so far. Right, guys, we're out here for the very moment. The sun dipping into the Caribbean Sea after the perfect day in Aruba. Good finish to the day? Yep. Pretty amazing. Pretty spectacular to be here with you, dude. Just sitting here watching this off the deck of a so cruise ship. Fun. Unreal. Unreal. This is insane. Look at this. You guys. Feeling the cruise vibes right now. The yes. island music. The boys have jumped in the pool again. <laughs> They're right behind his pool. This one's asking to go back to the room. She wants to go to bed. So I'm gonna take her to the bed and start editing. I'm gonna hang with the older Mom's boys. Hang here. An amazingly fantastic day here in Aruba. So Just the perfect day. Stay tuned tomorrow. We will be in Curacao. Come back tomorrow. Make sure you subscribe down below. Supposedly one of the most colorful painted cities in the world. So that should be fun. Hopefully oh, they get my drone awesome. back for that one. That would be cool. We love you so much. We will see you guys all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye.